Yo, what's up guys? It's uh... Homie FF from Space Station Gaming and I'm gonna be playing some Cocoon today. And we're starting off with Bluestone and... One thing... Oh, I have a really good ping. One thing you don't want to do is obviously don't get mana pots or multi pots because he doesn't have mana, so... I'm gonna be going Probably beads. I'm not really sure which actives are the best on him yet. Still really testing stuff out. Not really sure what's the best. It won't end well for you. <clears throat> Gonna start off my one. The three could be good. Uh, one thing you want to note, note when playing Kikolin is how much his abilities cost. His one costs nine rage. His three also costs nine rage. His two costs sixteen rage. And his ult costs 14 rage, rage. but if you hit ab abilities on enemies it costs less because this gives back 18 at max, this gives back 18 at max, and this gives back 36 at max. So if you hit your one on one creep it'll subtract your rage by three. And that's how, that's really how you're gonna try and stabilize your rage. Three the whole wave here. Not the hell pot. Forty-four rage right now. You also transform at eighty-five rage, which is something to note. Already pretty close to the. I could probably transform here, maybe. I gain nine from both. Don't really want to transform yet. I'm not gonna three those minions or not or one those minions. I think these Ellie's are up. Um, yes, they are. I'm probably gonna throw my one out, uh, just so I stay low on rage. Okay, Collins, there. He transformed. One thing you want to do, I think, with Kikolin is stay at the very edge of transforming, and then when you really want to transform, you transform. So right, I'm like really close to transforming, but I'm kind of just using abilities on nothing, so I don't transform yet. This kind of sucks right now. I'm kind of just using abilities on nothing. Just gonna not attack this. <laughs> what if the red's up? The red is down. Oracles are up. I can use my one on one creep to subtract three. Oh shit, oops. Well, I'm gonna transform by accident now. Maybe I can kill him here. Just gonna ult there. Oh shit. Forgot he's not coming me into that. Oops. Play that really bad. I don't have my jump here, so I gotta be really careful. Oh, Erwin gets him. Wow. That was a good play. Yeah, I didn't play that pretty bad. I transformed by accident, which is like really bad. <laughs> Oh, I sh actually, I was gonna say jumping out is probably bad. I'd lose five rage, but it's not that much. Oh, oh yeah. One thing to note is that jump range is really small. It's gonna get a mid wave. This looks like a pretty good game. Not stomping too hard, which is what I was afraid of when I'm playing casuals. Also, I don't put a point in my two because I think maybe put a point in your two is good. I'm not sure yet. I've been testing just not putting a point in your two early game. Just gonna 
transform here. So bad. That was so bad by me. The cast time on his ults are so long. I'm kinda learning this god as I'm playing. So right there on the Oh, I'm just running out. Yeah, on the um Uller I should have one ulted because my cast time on my ult is really long. Probably get some rage off this and then gank. Yeah, I should be able to transform here. Typically how you want to try and gank. Just gonna back here probably. You can't jump over this wall, that's something to note. I'm gonna be going gladiator shield. I think gladiator is really good on this god. Because your two is... Like your two procs, the gladiator shield. <clears throat> Putting no point in the two seems reliable for now. It was a little bit awkward early game because I was always attacking minions, so my rage was really high. So I'd have to spam abilities. Not on creeps. Oh shit. So what is this again? This is minus two if I hit one person. I ult minus two rage if I hit one person. I'm really close to... I kind of just don't want to fight anything right now. And then hit something and then go berserk. Be careful, land my way! On my way! Gank left lane! It's kind of insane how much rage I gain. I can almost transform again. That's the thing about this god. If there's a lot of minions, you can always get your ult up. See, I'm gonna be getting it here right now. I three this, one this. A few more auto attacks, and I'm already gonna be berserk. I'm actually gonna save it, go back. Or I could. 
or I really don't want to attack this. Oh, I guess I could attack it with my one because it's minus three. Minus three rage. On one attack. Oh, uh, whatever. Uh, I'm gonna be rage. Oh shit, I can maybe? No, I can't. I forget, how much is it? It's 12. So it'd be plus 10 if I hit two people, and it would be plus. Maybe taunts them? Uh. For this, gonna be de-transforming soon. Souls coming into their left. Yeah, this god is really strong. Every time you transform, you get a whole new set of abilities. Like, and they're always off cooldown. This is what is it again? Plus three? Yeah, plus three if you hit two. Yeah, not putting a point in the two seems pretty good so far. Just because it, it, your two procs on your ult, or when you go berserk, your two's procking. That is when it's the most valuable. It will go blink. Blink seems pretty good. Don't really need Aegis. Hmm. I actually don't want to do these back cams. <laughs> I don't really know. It's really awkward trying to farm because I don't want to like transform right now. Like, I want to transform when we're fighting. I just can't do backs, I guess. <laughs> I can maybe clean this up alone actually, I think. I got this guy for sure, I think. Unless they have more CC. Oh no. Maybe I can just run away now. <laughs> Ooh. Yeah, I'm out of here. I played that pretty bad. I proc the um the portal demon by accident. I could go berserk here maybe. One more ability rotation on this blue probably. Yeah, this god is this god is actually insane. If you get, I need to get the timing on his. Um, holy! I, if I get the timing red on his berserk, this god is OP for sure. I think. Gonna back here, get Jotun's Wrath. I think CDR is definitely important on this god. I'm gonna go Void Stone here, or Void Shield. CDR is definitely important on this god because you always wanna be 3ing and 2ing. If you're not getting Berserk in a fight, you're definitely not a good god. So CDR is important. Also, you might wanna, in team fights, I wonder how it's gonna work, but. 
you might want to just make sure you're at high rage before you fight always. The one thing about when you, I keep thinking when you transform as your ult, but when you berserk and you three, it's like a weird Herc one. It's not exactly like Herc one. It like pushes them, but they don't go with you like immediately. It's really weird. Okay, you went this way. Actually, maybe I can. want to use my two that's the thing I feel like your right tower. using your twos unless you really don't want to berserk like say you're farming back camps or something and you have a high rage maybe maybe it's good but other than that I feel like 15 16 is like kind of a lot Oh shit. Fuck. An enemy has been slain. Yeah, I tried using my two there, but it was definitely not good because I got my berserk really late. Not really sure how you're supposed to be using your two. Because in normal stance, his two is really bad. It takes so much rage and you don't refill it. It's pretty much why we lost the fights because I didn't get my berserk in time. Your right tower is under attack. His one and three in berserk form are really strong. That makes him really good, I think. Also, one thing to note is you can always see the rage on the cocoon, so you can always tell when he's going to be berserking. Gets a little hot under the collar. Haven't you heard some stories? What's the right way to eat Welsh cheese? He's down. Oh, sweet stuff. Keep forgetting. What is it? Plus nine. Yeah. Plus nine on both of these. If you hit all three. If I get a huge ult here, I can maybe berserk. Use my ability so I don't berserk. Oh, just so. Berserking here.
if ult in two, maybe I can turn this around. Oh no. Yeah, I can't really help. If you live for like another second, maybe. Oh, maybe I can turn this. Still not enough. Oh no. I messed it up really badly. It's not my two from moving speed, I guess. I could have got Berserk there. I played it really bad though. I missed my one on like three of them. If I got Berserk there, that could have been a game changing fight. Just got it. On my Burn some steam. Sweet, sweet. On my way. On my way. I'll gank. More damage doesn't seem that good, honestly. I really need some defense. On my way. Spear rub, maybe. Enemy missing. Enemies at fire giant. Yes, yes. Ooh, looks like they got it. It's too bad. It's like they say, the windy day is not the day for thatch waters. Ever been to Scotland? Lovely place, but how do they tell which restroom is for whom? <laughs> I'm coming for you, buddy. How you doing? Oh my god, yeah, no, this god is like... And I, I can actually tell, like... Already the... Actually... Hmm, maybe in team fights you can get huge ults and then get your berserk. Be careful, left! Save yourself! But right now, I have nothing to farm, so my berserk is really low. That's ridiculous. Your middle tower is under attack. Killing. Oh my god. That's what I had to fetch. Your team has destroyed a right in your left tower has been destroyed. What's the right way to eat well? Ultimate is ready! I'll attack! Zerking here in a second. Gotta get my ult off. I can 
almost get another ult off. 21 seconds, how much does this last? 25? Wait. Berserk 20. Oh. Really need to build up some rage off this. I got a huge ult there, so I got a ton of berserk or rage. I keep it, so, so I gained 22 rage from that. That's kind of a lot. Ow. Getting owned here. Haha. <laughs> still die really fast. <laughs> Guess that's a game. Your Titan is under attack. Oh shit! Oh, that's too bad. Well, that's gonna be a cone gameplay for me. If you guys have uh, any requests on which gods you would like me to play, I'll leave it in the comments section below. But uh, yeah, that's gonna be it for me. Thanks for watching.